I'm just pausing for a moment to let you hear the stillness of the trees and their inhabitants. I am on what's called Chantry Island. I'm not sure whether it ever had water around it. It doesn't have now, but it's still a little place set apart that you wouldn't really know exists unless you were here. Well, here or in the local area. So this is reputed to be the place where Amphibius, the Christian priest, resided. And it was from here that the Romans came to arrest him for practicing Christianity. It's believed that Alban, as in Saint Alban, disguised himself as Amphibius and was arrested instead. He was then taken from this spot and brought to the town of St. Alban. At that time, you can see someone's made a little shrine here. At that time, for a as called by the Romans. And it was there on the hill that he was beheaded. And he was, from that point, considered to be the first Christian martyr of England, if not Britain. But this place is very quietly known, or all known. Certainly I hadn't known about it. And it was only in one Easter on a walk that I came across it. I was here that perhaps as a four year old that I sat with the sea and we used to make our names from branches on this bit of the of the ground. And it was here that I remember telling you a story about We being pregnant in the belly of God. That our existence was like a baby in a womb, like her in the womb of her mother. That we exist on this earth, this beautiful earth, as if in the womb of God. To be born into a new life at one time. Now, there's a private development quite close by now, and we don't know whether that will mean that we can't get access to this place. That being the case, I'm making sure I get the video up. So, I'm going to leave, but I'm going to walk to where it says private. Doesn't it quite say keep out? It says private. Hoping that we can still come, even though like most of this area, it's going to become expensive flats nearby. Good lesson in pulling rather than puffing. 